Hey, you guys, it's your girl, Deborah. Look at this beautiful hat. It's really, really nice. It came together very, very fast. It's a simple, simple layout hat, but the colors make it look really, really detailed. This is a men's size crochet beanie hat. It's really, really comfortable. It's thick. It's plushy, and I think any man would love it. It'll make for a really good gift. I don't want us to sleep on our men for the holiday season. We tend to focus a lot on making things for women or girls, and I don't want us to sleep on our men this year. So this little hat will get you started on a really, really simple project that should come together in a little of no time i think it took me maybe about a little less than an hour to come to, for this hat to come together so i think it should be about the same for you even if you're a beginner it should be a little bit over an hour shouldn't be hard at all if you like videos like this consider hitting that subscribe button if i'm explaining things well that you where you can understand it hit that like button now let's get started with the video i want to go over some of the materials now these are the yarns that i used this this is, I love this cotton, and this is Lakefront, and it's an acrylic number four. This is cinnamon, and I got this at Joann's. It's the Big Twist, and it's also a, a number four weight. You will need a 5.5 hook and a pair of scissors. And that's pretty much it. Now let's get started. Okay, you guys, let's start out. We're going to do this from the top down. So we're going to start out with a magic circle. If you're not familiar with the magic circle, I do have a video to show you how to do the magic circle. I would try to link it to the video or drop it down in the description. So we're going to start out with a chain of three. That's we are going to count this as one of our chains. We're going to do 11 more double crochets inside the circle. So in total, we should have 12 double crochets inside of our circle. Take the little tail, pull it, close your circle off. Find the top stitch, go into the top stitch, grab the yarn, slip stitch it off. And then chain two, one, two. Okay, we're going to go right back into this space right here. This round will be an all increase round. That means we're increasing in each space. So that's, that's considered two. We'll go to the next space, the next stitch, and do two double crochets inside of that one. Then the next one, we'll do another two double crochets. And in the next one, we'll do another two double crochets. Okay, so that's the pattern all the way around till we reach back here is two double crochets inside of each stitch all the way around and I'll meet you back. This will be 23 and 24. So we have 24 stitches in this round. Find the top loop. Find this top loop right here. Go in it. Slip stitch it off, chain two, one, two, chain two, you can go back into that same stitch again. This would be an increase. So this is an increase right here, one, two, but the next one, we're going to do one double crochet inside of this stitch. The next stitch, we'll do two double crochet. So it's going to be an increase inside the same stitch the next stitch we're going to do one double crochet the next stitch we're going to do two double crochets inside the same stitch the next stitch we're going to do one double crochet and in the next stitch we're going to do two double crochets which is an increase that's the pattern we're going to be doing all the way around. One double crochet in that, that stitch, an increase in this stitch. One double crochet in this stitch, an increase in this stitch. One double crochet, an increase. Increase means two double crochets inside of one stitch. Okay, and that's the end of that round. Go into the top 
find that, slip stitch it off, and chain two. Now we're going to do the pattern for this one is one, one, two. So we're going to go, this will be the one. We're going to go right here and make another one. So that's two, one, and then we're going to do a two, an increase in this space right here. So we did a single crochet in that stitch, a single crochet in that stitch, and then an increase, two double crochets inside of that stitch. So that's the pattern is one double crochet, one double crochet, two double crochets inside the same stitch, an increase. One in that stitch, one in that stitch, and then two in the next stitch. And that's the pattern all the way around. One, one, two, one, one, two. So it'll be one, one increase, one, one increase. And I'll see you when we make it to the other end. Okay, we're coming up on the end of this round. Find the top stitch, grab the yarn, slip stitch it off, chain two again. We're gonna go into this chain over here. Chain one, so that's one, two. Another one in this one makes three. And then we're gonna do an increase in the next one. So you have one, two, three, increase. And that's the pattern for this round. One, two, three, and then an increase. And that's the pattern for that round. One, two, three, increase. One, two, three, increase. And then I'll see you when we get to the other side. Okay, we'll finish with that row. Go into the top, slip stitch it off, chain two, one, two. This is our last increase row now, so it'll be four. Go into the first one, that's number two, because we considered that as a, a stitch. It's two, three, four, and then an increase. So, so now it's one, two, three, four, increase. Two stitches in one space, one, two, three, four, and two in the next. Okay, finish that roll up. So it's one, two, three, four, increase, one, two, three, four, increase. And I'll see you when we get to the other side. Okay, we're at the end of this row. Let's slip stitch it, chain two. That was the end of our increases. So now we're just gonna go all the way around with one double crochet inside of each stitch. We don't have to do any more increases. So it's just one single double crochet inside of each stitch all the way around. And I'll see you when we get to the other side. Okay, I am finished with this row right here with one double crochet inside of each stitch. Chain two. Chain two, and you're, you're going to continue on putting one single double crochet inside of each stitch for the next five rounds. In total, you should have 12 rounds. And I'll meet you back once I make it to my 12th round. Okay, you guys, I am coming up on my 13th row. I had told you guys to go up 12 rows, and 12 rows is fine. But I went up 13. I needed mine to be just a little bit longer, so I went up one extra row. So this is 13 and not 12. You can feel free to make it whatever size you want it to be, but I decided to take mine up one extra row. So I did 13 rows from top to bottom. I'm going to work on the, the rim of it, and I'm going to change my color. Change to my cinnamon. Go into here, 
slip stitch in there pull it through pull it through and chain two okay we chained up two we're going to do a front post double crochet then we're going to do one in the normal stitch double crochet so it'd be like this go around the post right here go under it pull it down that's a double crochet then the next one we're going to go back into the regular stitch that we normally work in and make a normal double crochet so when i say normal that's what i mean then go back under the post and then go back into the normal space we normally stitch in I'll see you guys when I make it to the other end. Okay, chain two. And on this round, we're going to go front post double crochet in on every stitch. Front post crochet on every stitch. Front post crochet. Front post crochet. Okay, so we're going to do a front post double crochet in every stitch all the way around, and we're going to do it for the next two rows. So I'll see you when you get to your, the end of your second row. Okay, coming up on this last one. So I'm going to slip stitch into this top stitch. Pull it in, slip stitch it off. Find my scissors. Clip it. wrap it pull it through and you sew in your ends and this is your nice cozy gentleman's hat it's about 21 to 22 inches it's really really cozy thick and it's got a nice color <laughs> Next time, I'll see you guys later. Bye.